right, here we go. Bout number three is scheduled for six rounds of heavyweight boxing. The referee in charge is Mr. Bob Howard, fighting out of the blue corner. He came in from Perry, Georgia. He weighed in at a lean, one, 201 even. He brings in his undefeated 4-0 professional record, all by KO. He is Dante Go Hard Williams. And fighting out of the red corner, He's from Los Angeles, California, by way of the Ukraine and Georgia. He's accompanied by the 2023 International Boxing Hall of Fame inductee, Joe Goosen. He weighed in at 265 pounds even. He's a 2020 Ukrainian Olympian with an undefeated professional record of three wins, no losses, all by KO. He is Sotne, Mr. T. Rukala. So me, obviously, with a, uh, a very well-known trainer, which also often means that, you know, you get a lot of good sparring. You get a lot of good work uh, when you train train in a gym like Telgu. Uh, uh, you, uh, you have a Hall of Famer as your, as your trainer. It means you're, uh, you're often in the gym with other great fighters. And that's, that's really, especially when you come to boxing late, that, that's a big part of how you sort of... Uh, pick up your skill level or get there like Chris being with uh, with team Benavides you know just being in a gym with uh, with world-class uh, fighters kind of ups your game and ups your level uh, absolutely and uh, Mr. T as we call him he just sparred 12 rounds the other day and he does a lot of sparring with Big Gook so he's very polished oh he's doing Ooh. good good yeah. oh hey. big big shots so and, you know, Dante is eating some big shots. He's showing heart, but. Oh, oh. that may be it. Oh. Hey. Is that it? So uh, they might be counting it as a knockdown, saying that the ropes saved him, which they did. Um, you know, I, I, he's eating some big shots. There's, there's no question Dante Williams' heart right now, but. I think this fight may be over in the next it's couple of seconds. Soon. It's a, we're only so, 90 minutes, 90 seconds into oh, round one. Yeah. So, and I like, uh, you know, Rogava is, he's mixing up his combinations. He's throwing head, body. Uh, hey. Oh, hey. oh big guy. hook. Oh. oh, big right hand. It's over. So, it's over. There you yeah. have it. Oh. Mr. T, very Mr. impressive. T, very impressive. You said it. So. You did the same. You can see Dante Williams is unhappy, but the ref, I think the ref saved him from a very vicious, yes. brutal knockout because he he really couldn't hold himself up. He got he got lucky and unlucky that he was in the ropes that way. It, it kept him up, but it was going to keep him getting hurt worse. But, but Adam, look, here's a guy that hasn't fought in a year and a half. He's new to the sport, only has three fights, and looks as sharp as can be. So being in the right camp makes a big difference. Being in the right environment, he's obviously... A fan favorite representing Georgia and, and Ukraine. So, and uh, the fans got a treat. People love big knockouts. Yeah, look, and, and he showed himself to be, you know, he's he's someone in the heavyweight division to watch. Obviously, he's got more work to do, but uh, there's a reason he was an Olympian. He, he has that experience. He just showed us he has real power, uh, good boxing ability. You know, like you said, he doesn't have... He doesn't have that body that screams to you, athlete. But physically, he's he's able to he's able to do a lot, and he he just knows how to fight. So uh, impressive performance. I haven't seen him before, and uh, you know I, I'd be excited to see more of him. Very nice person, by the way. Just like Chris, very 
in the ring vicious, but out of the ring, just a nice, very approachable person. And I'm happy for him. He, he got it, respected his opponent. 4 0 4 knockouts, took the challenge on. And, and it's uh, funny when you said that yesterday at the weigh in, right, very approachable, very nice. Let's let's send the it up to our ring announcer, then we'll talk a little more about it. three of the first round, your winner, Bakayo Zopne. Have it hands. Yeah. You call it. Chris, what does it feel like to knock someone out? It feels like God.